Yes. Okay. All right, guys. So I've been drinking ginger shots religiously. I started doing them when I was in Miami about two months ago. I was extremely hungover, and I looked up how to not die. And I ended up going and buying ginger shots. I got obsessed with them. But when you go places, they're like $8 for some dumbass shot. So I've been making my own. I've been talking about it on my Instagram story. And you guys have all been asking about how to do it, what to do. So first off, you're going to want some ginger. Now, preface. I need to say this real quick. I get it. Spinach juice, kale juice, greens, all this stuff. Yeah, it's good for you. Ginger shots are instant. They are incredible for you and it's instant. They're beautiful. So you're gonna need some ginger. You're gonna need some lemon. You're gonna need a sharp fucking object. And you're gonna need a, what is called a nut milk bag. Okay, so you need the nut milk bag. And here's what you're gonna need. You wanna wash off the ginger because we live in a carcinogenic world, right? You're gonna have gasoline all over your ginger. You're gonna have the tears of somebody's mother. You're gonna have a lot of nonsense on the ginger. So you just, you wipe it down. And a lot of times I'm just breaking it off. I'm tossing it in. Um, I have the knife ready really for the lemon, but you can just break this bitch up. You need a blender also. It ain't gonna happen without a blender. You could just kind of mince it. You could hire somebody just to mince up your ginger, but I recommend just getting a blender. You're gonna save money. Now what I do is I put in really the least amount of water I can. So I'll pretty much go up to the top of the ginger. So we get some cold water. Nothing like a little wall water. All right, and then what we're gonna do is I start off with the low pulse chop. So I give it a little of this. Okay, then I'll go high pulse shock. And then, there we go. Now, when the blender acts like that, that means that you're really close to having enough water. I'm gonna add just a little more. Boom, just like that. And now it's probably gonna give me a good clean swirl. Blend this bitch up a little bit. All right, now the next phase here. You're gonna take your glass, okay, like a this, and then you're gonna put your nut milk bag all the way down in there, pretty much like as far down as you can go. Kind of like use the knife actually to push it down a little. Oh, that's smart, poke holes in it. All right, and then you are going to take this little blend here and you are going to dump it in the nut milk bag. You wanna go slow, it's gonna start kind of filling up to the top. And as it starts filling up, you can kind of pull the bag up a little bit. Okay, so there we go. Now I'm all about maximizing. That's what my whole life is about, is optimizing. Some of you are like, I started following this guy to fuck girls. Now he's making ginger shots, who is this? All right, so I like to maximize and get everything out of there. Sometimes I'll actually cut my fingers on the blades in here and then you get a nice little taste of your own blood, which is, which is honestly good for all men, I think. I think we don't taste our blood enough. So you're gonna toss that in there. And then essentially what you're gonna wanna do is again, you'll see it's like very packed, right? It's filled to the brim. Here's what you do, you come up, all right? You're gonna let a lot of that excess water just start to, start to chill for a sec. And then you're really just gonna, you're really just gonna fucking do it like this. Now, you could do it with a bowl. I was doing it with a bowl to not get any juice anywhere, but now I just have Alpha Chad come out here and clean up the ginger juice when I'm done. So just get yourselves an assistant and you'll be good to go. All right, so you squeeze all that out. Oh, and now we just got that fatty shot. Now, in here, you're just gonna have a bunch of fiber. And what you wanna make sure you do, I made a mistake of actually permanently molding one of my last ones. I was like, oh, let me dump this out and then uh, I'll clean it in a couple days. It permanently molded. I couldn't get the mold off at all. So what you're gonna wanna do really is just dump out the fiber and just rinse it off really well. I hang it up here. You can put it in a strainer. We'll do that in a minute off the vid. But this is the ginger shot. I mean, this is really it. Now, me personally, because I am very high testosterone, I'm a very alpha male, I am typically going to, uh, let me say something real quick. Again, you go to some smoothie shop, $8, and you're getting this, okay? 
You go to the Evolution Daily Kitchen of Nightmares and you get this and it's like $3. $3, what am I, 50 cents, a dollar, it's nothing. So now I'm typically going to mix this up a little bit and I'm just gonna go all the way in. Woo! Oh, that's a potent one, that's good. Now, um, I don't even, you know what, man, I just, I really, I barely use the lemon myself these days. I'll probably save this lemon for something else. All you would do is just chop this bitch up, squeeze a bunch of lemon, whatever, let's do it. So you're gonna chop this up, Evolution Daily Kitchen of Horrors, and uh, I like to go into quarters, because then you can really make sure you're squeezing it out, and not only that, but also you can get some of the seeds out of here. Okay, pop out these seeds. Sometimes you'll be taking a shot, you'll find a seed in here and that's no good. So you can just squeeze some lemon in here. And not only is that lemon going to also be very good for you, but also it's gonna make it taste really good. So I'll just go quarter lemon for now, for the sake of the vid, but you can really put in as much as you want. Again, use that same knife, blend it up a little bit. Still rough, but that lemon really, it makes a big difference. And the reason I want, I want to say this real quick, the reason why I drink this, again, I first really was getting into them when I looked up kind of like hangover stuff, but then the reason why it really helps you with the hangover is because it's decreasing inflammation throughout the entire body. So I've actually noticed that this will also give me energy. Uh, this will also, I wouldn't say that I have knee pain, but I have one knee that's a little fucked up. Me and my buddy Joe Bagden, during X-Men 3 in high school, we're racing up escalators. And if you know anything about escalators, they have those like brutal teeth that poke out and we were running up and I'm fat and I fell and busted my knee on the teeth of the escalator. Uh, so it's really never been the same. I was bleeding everywhere, I was crying, I got stuck in it, they had to come like pull me out. It was nuts. Uh, and so this helps even with some joint pain, maybe some lower back pain, and ultimately it's just gonna bring you closer to God. So uh, that's about it. A lot of you guys were requesting this from me, so we'll go ahead and end the vid. Give it a like or a heart if you plan on making your own alpha male evolution daily ginger shot, and we'll see you in the next vid.